Good morning, everyone. We are here from the Yamanota area. Yeah, <laughs> good morning. <laughs> and uh, it's around 6 a.m. We wanted to do this hike for you, hike up to the Yamanota hill, which is the highest hill on the island. Yep. And uh, it's quite early, it's a bit dark, but as we go up, we'll start seeing the sunrise this time. We wanted to do something a little bit different and in the past we've had folks asking for a sunrise yes. video. So I this like is it. it and let's go. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> so as we stopped the car to start this hike we could hear all of the birds singing i mean like really really loud which is beautiful and uh, we are walking more or less towards the north northeast direction and uh, again we're head is up here where you see the light and I think we saw but not sure of it I think we saw an owl just driving here I don't think you can appreciate it on the video, but the light is just really, really beautiful. Yeah, it is, it's uh, a really beautiful color. It's like already like an orange-ish. Yes. <laughs> so we're aiming for 622. The sunrise, the actual sunrise, we still have parts of this road to head up to the um, the actual climb to of the of the hill itself, and uh, it's around a hundred eighty meters, more or less but not 190. Officially, I do believe it's 188, something like that. While the Adikok Hill, not far from here, is like three meters less than this one. And uh, years ago, before the park existed, so we are in the national park right now. Before the park existed, you could drive with a regular car through this road and drive all the way up to the hill. Nowadays, it's closed only for officials, park rangers, etc. This is definitely rattlesnake specialty area. <laughs> we do hope to see one this morning. Oh, a dead one. Yeah? Oh. Heard something here. No, not spotting anything. So we're gonna speed up the pace a little bit so we can get a good climb.
already stopped because there's a lot of lot of bird up here on the ground. Quite large. I think you see something. He's watching it. Yeah, this is a big one. Yeah. I'll probably fly away as we walk closer. I'll try to. There he goes. It's too early to fly, I guess. <laughs> There he goes again. This one let us be quite close to it, huh? Yeah. Usually they fly away quite quickly. It's probably looking for food this morning. Mm. And it's standing just on top of that cactus, you know. I don't know if you guys can see it. I know somebody said it looks like a chicken. No, it's not a chicken. It's one of the most beautiful birds on the island, actually. Look at that. Kind of looks like a small eagle. Beautiful. And it's amazing how they stand on top of the cactus just like that. That's their safe place, because they know us humans cannot get on top of the cactus. Oh, now there are two. Yeah. Oh, that's why they're making that noise. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry for that. Quick stop. Hope you're enjoying this walk so far. If you are, give it a like button. And uh, why not just make sure that you are subscribed for more content from Aruba. And uh, yeah, we still have ways to go to the top. Certainly in a few more meters, we start the actual tough climb where I'll probably have to walk, work, not walk, work on my breeding. Oh, these are signs of donkeys, wild donkeys. Yeah. Yeah, oh, I haven't heard that. So this hill is actually Cerro de Cabay. We've been up here a while back. And that will translate into Horse Hill. It's quite a uh, high, tall uh, hill as well. And now we'll start with the actual Cerro Yamanota. Now, cameras have a, a way of making things not look as steep. This is a pretty steep climb. 
Let's go for it. Oh, now I hear them, yeah. Mm -hmm. The goats. This is the steepest part of, probably, right? One of the steepest part of the hike up. And it's hard to get the muscles going early morning. <laughs> no coffee yet either. <laughs> bad time to remember about, to remind about the coffee look at that beautiful sky We're hoping for catching the sun <laughs> from the uh, the actual sun coming up at the seaside back here somewhere. But I don't know. Seems like uh, quite cloudy. Excuse my heavy breathing, by the way. Ooh. Oh, there's a water water again, up there. <laughs> they are beautiful. I love this breeze. There it goes, screaming away. Two of them, as I said, as they start their day, it's just beautiful, as you are. Oh, come on. I can do it. No. Cheer me up. <laughs> this is probably the... I thought the first part was, but this might be oh, the steepest no, uh, part, right? Yeah, this is the hardest. The temperature is it good? Yeah, it is good. <laughs> yeah, the breeze is just <laughs> very good. Makes it very, very pleasant, actually. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> there's ice cream and a McDonald's. Yeah, there's a McDonald's up <laughs> at the end. Now, the McDonald's, I don't know, but if I say there's coffee up there, that would be mean. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So we look back. Again, say it goodbye, North Shore. Oh, walking backwards seems easier right now. Whew. 
there are the two other lovebirds. I, I think the last one inside a, a baby. Oh. Because he was feeding him. Oh, okay. Then my excuse is you're not lovebirds. <laughs> It's just... It's a big baby. Yeah. Woo. My calves are... Just have many questions right now for me. <laughs> Why? More signs of the donkeys, donkeys, and it's not donkey, thank you, it's actually donkeys. Folks have been referring the word to donkey, which means thank you in our Papiamento language. They are uh, something different. <laughs> And uh, we've hiked actually quite a bit of this area, except this valley leading to the north coast. We've hiked back there quite a bit. It's all beautiful, but it can also be very warm, very hard. But it's uh, very different probably to what you have back home. Ooh. We do have hiking tours. If you're interested, visit the website www.letsgowithairo.com. You can find out more about that if you're interested in uh, us taking you there. And we can discuss the possibilities. Yeah, we start to see civilization, I guess, where we see the Hoiberg Hill, we see the airport, etc and partially the Palm Beach area even. Ooh, had a very steep part coming up. Let's get that breathing in. Every time I say that's that was the steepest part, there's of course a worse one. <laughs> wow. <laughs> well, it's got the pace going. Ooh. No snakes to today or at least this morning mm -hmm. yet. Mm -hmm. That was one of our hopes, I guess. Mm -hmm. Almost there. Oh. 
almost there, kind of. So on top of this hill, <coughs> excuse me, you cannot go to the complete top, the very, very top anymore. So it's been closed off. And uh, up there you can find, let's just say important antennas for the island. So <laughs> the past years you could have gone past this uh, road and go up there where that, where that antenna is situated. And of course there's always a gap, <laughs> if you know what I mean, if you saw it. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's nonetheless a very, very beautiful spot of the island for sure. And uh, let's take a look at the time. It's 6.21, so should be checking out. By the way, I just wanted to show the folks. This is also an old snake. <laughs> so they are around. I'm gonna stand on top of this one. Let's see if we can turn back. So uh, yeah, more or less, uh, let's see. So I can see, uh, is this the, a little bit confused, is that the driving? I think the driving should be over there somewhere. Not sure what this is, but more or less Savoneta, Pochiquito Barcadera area, Palashi and such. The airport, the Hoiberg, way back there the hotels the palm beach area tourist touristic area i'd say and then parts of this is the national park so back of one of those hills is the park entrance and all of this is the national park i do see some folks coming up some other hikers coming up but uh we don't see the sun unfortunately it's a bit too cloudy Sorry to disappoint you guys, <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's been a tough but nice hike mm -hmm. and uh, a lot of hiking trails here in the area. I'll show you just one of them briefly. Sorry for the turning around quickly, but so if you are up here, you can start going down this one here. We're not going to do that today, but it's a very interesting one going down. So you go down here and take a ride to your car. So we want to thank you for watching this, this one with us. Yeah, thank you so much for watching. <laughs> Being here with us meant to say and uh, it was fun mm -hmm. uh, it's uh, nice to be up here for the sunrise yeah. right yeah <laughs> <laughs> a bit tough waking up because we did have to wake up quite early mm -hmm. but we do it with all of the love it for you guys yeah. yeah thanks for watching again
Thank you. Wish you a beautiful day. See you in the next, next one. Bye-bye, <laughs> guys. Bye -bye.